Over 1.2 square kilometers of prime Siberian wood worth half a million dollars. At the end of the day, it's payback time. Back at the test cut, there's even more good news. After five weeks of work in the freezing cold, Zach Sheets is about to cut the final harvestable tree on the cut. But it's a poignant moment for the 22-year-old. Here I am. About eight months ago, I was cutting with a, a good friend of mine, and he uh, looked over to me and basically said, tree coming down, which is totally normal, you know? The tree came down, it hit another tree, and it basically bent the tree over, and when it came back, the top broke out of it, flew back and landed all over him, and killed him right away. And that's the reality of cutting trees like this. I don't like to be in this position. It's on to the real money, guys. No more screwing around. Well, I'm gonna get out of here with the harvester. We can pack things up and start moving to the next unit. Hey, hey. We're on our way to bigger and better things and a whole lot bigger future here in Siberia with this next new cutting block that we're headed to. I'm ready to get out of here. I'm ready to go put some money in my pocket. Way to kick some ass, guys. Now I just gotta get these trees off the ground. Sean should get $50,000 from the test cut. Enough to pay his men for their first month in Siberia. 